before you start adding JSON information to Edge, you have to learn how to write a JSON file. And it's pretty easy. I'm going for like totally the simplest thing. And it's pretty much an array. So we'll start with an open square bracket. Square, square, there we go. And I'm going to skip some spaces. Just skip a bunch, I don't care. And I'll close my square brackets. Now in between here, we start putting our information, which starts with a curly brace. And I'm going to keep this to three little things. I'm going to do um, open quotes uh, first, as in first name. And I'll add a name, OK, and a comma. Then I'll go and do another one, last, and a colon, and then a last name, Smith. Close it. And a comma. And I'll add an age. Two quotes, colon, and 59. Now, I'm not putting a comma after that one. We're going to put a curly brace, because that's the last item in there. Comma. Now I'm just going to copy this a couple times and just change the information. So, and, and one more time. Now, the very last one, don't keep that comma. It's nothing but trouble. So I'm going to change the names to uh, Andy Smith. Dana Smith and Sam Smith. All right. Of course, they're not all 59. Let's leave Andy at, uh, let's make him 47. Let's make uh, Dana 32. And let's make Sam 25. Okay. So I can save this as a JSON file, but the smartest thing I can do is I can get online and make sure this stuff's all right. So I'm going to copy it all, Command C. I'm going to jump on to line, and I am going to look for an, a, uh, I got it here, JSON editor online. So it would be JSON, J-S-O-N-E-D-I-T-O-R. O-N-L-I-N-E dot org. So I'm going to select all and I'm going to paste. There's my stuff. And I, oops, there's an error. Undefined. So that's because I have two quotation marks right there in a row. And because there's two of them, it messes everything up. It's easier to correct them over in your Word, in your text wrangler. So I have this single quote thing, which should be a comma. And same thing here, should be a comma. You have to be really careful, comma and comma. Select all, copy, jump over, paste. Here we go, it's created our arrays. You can see them. Each one is there. That's one way to do it. So we know that this file right here is just fine. So I'm going to save it. And I can save it as the um, short dot JSON, short JSON. And I'm going to put it in my, um, I'm going to put it on my desktop. And I'm going to create a new folder. And I'll just call it um, names and can't create and say and you notice I have a little text thing there. I don't want that delete that and save boom that's done now what if you have a uh, spreadsheet so I'm gonna open my spreadsheet here we go there's a spreadsheet and I did pretty much the same thing got new names but pretty much the same thing and I've selected them all. And if I go File, Export to the CSV uh, format. I'm just going to say, what do you want to do? I say, that's it. What are you going to name it? Long names. OK, I got long names, CSV. I can, uh, I'll export it into names. Might as well put everything where same place, Export. 
and I can hide this. So I can quit this, quit numbers, don't save. Now, the thing is, I need to open that up and I'll go to my desktop and names and long names and I can uh, open that up in Text Wrangler and you can see how it's come through. Uh, I don't need all this extra stuff so I'm gonna delete that. Any extra commas I'm gonna delete. Now I've tried a couple times to get rid of these extra commas. I don't know what I'm doing wrong but it's just as easy for me to select these and delete them as me to screw around and try and figure out what the story is. So I'm gonna delete them. Whoops, need that. And I'll do the same thing up here just delete them now there we go I'm gonna select all of these copy hide that now I'm gonna go back online and I want to find a converts to um, I want uh, CVS to Jason and here we go right here CVS to Jason converter pasted it once and I'm going to click the reset so it says I have five fields one two three four five so let's do it this way make sure you got convert CVS to JSON there it is I'm gonna get in there copy it all I will go back here I will paste it in note that it's formatted properly mm -hmm. save as because I want to reset up save as what am I going to save it as? Long names dot JSON. There you go. And perfectly formatted. 